In this lesson, we're going to add the pie progress. So you want to click on that. And then just leave everything as the default. You can add an icon. Let's choose one here. Just and you can put the, the title, put the content, but don't change anything except the moment. I just want you to see what this looks like. All right, so there you have the pie, you know, progress. This is at about seven to five percent. So let's come here and let's create another column. And let's copy this and drag it over, drag it over. Okay, let's change this one from 7 to 5 to, let's say I want this to be 10% complete. Now, this is good for demonstrations. You know, they're really great for, for demonstration purposes. And you can change the color. Let's, you see the bar color is just light gray here, and the, the percentage is just blue. So let's say you want to change that. Or you can leave the, the bar color at that. Let's change the progress. Let's put that to a darker green. And then you can here you can set the, the bar width. Let's try 10. And then icon size icon size you can have tiny, medium, large, extra large. Alright, let's try large. And then you want to click on save and let's edit this one. All right, we're going to keep this one, just put this at 50%. And then you choose the size here that you want it to be. And let's change the color for this one to like that. And then the bar width, we can leave that at 5. And let's choose a different icon, a cog, and then save. So you have three columns now. And let's refresh the page to see what it looks like. So you have here, this one is 10%, this one is 50%, and this one is 75%. So it gives you something to work with if you want to, you know, present some type of data uh, on your website.